you are at New York University in uh, Manhattan, New York University runs a center for brain imaging. There's different parts of the brain, and the brain's not just one big blob. There's different regions of the brain that do different things. There's other parts of the brain that are involved in social cognition, understanding what's in somebody else's mind. The right temporal parietal junction, right about here, kind of on the side of the back of your brain. This part of the brain is, is really important for theory of mind, and theory of mind is basically understanding what's in somebody else's mind. Basically what you did is you saw faces, and we started by taking uh, a doll face and a human face that look kind of alike, and we morphed them using computer software so that it went 100% doll, 0% human, in 10% increments. So it was 100% doll, then you might saw another face that was 90% doll, 10% human. If, you, if you're a committed American, a highly identified American, that part of the brain, you know, it's responding to the in-group. It's really responsive when you're, when you're seeing in-group members and thinking about what their goals are and their plans, their agency. But with the out-group, it's not really sensitive to their experiences. And it's the same way if you think about Democrats and Republicans, um, Americans versus Russians. In many situations, you get this kind of us versus them mentality. The Republicans in Congress do not have standing. I think this is a big part of it, is that you don't take their ideas seriously, or you think that they're cold-hearted. You'll see this in the, the political rhetoric. Democrats will talk about how Republicans don't care about women, you know, like they're completely insensitive to their concerns. And you'll hear Republicans talk about things like uh, Democrats uh, don't care about, you know, the suffering of, um, of fetuses. This is part of like the pro-life issue. And so they both assume that the other group isn't empathic, doesn't care about certain groups. Oftentimes that's not the truth. It's just that they, they see the issue differently in certain ways. But we tend to deny other groups uh, a sense of humanity, a sense of empathy. And, and this leads to really negative things if we don't take their experiences seriously.